the power of God be our strength. May Christ dwell in our hearts through faith. May we know the depths of His love and immeasurable grace that saves. May the power of God be our strength. May Christ dwell in our hearts through faith. May we know the depths of His love and immeasurable grace that saves. My God can do more than you can imagine. My God can do more than you could ask. My God will do more than you can fathom. Even if all of your dreams come true, there will still be May the power of God be our strength. May the power of God be our strength. May Christ dwell in our hearts through faith. May we know the depths of His love and immeasurable grace. That's my God can do more. Oh, my God can do more than you can imagine. said, my God can do immeasurably more than you could ever ask or imagine. I just want you to take a minute, just get that in your hearts. Do I believe that? To what extent am I willing to believe that? Do I believe that you're just some distant God who's not really interested in me? Or do I believe that the things that are important to me are important to you because you love me? 
Do I believe that because you're a good father, you care about me, you care about what's going on in my heart, in my life? And God, if you do care about me, then then is it true that your dreams for me are better than my dreams for myself? That your plan for my life, your plan for my life is better than everything that I dream up for myself, God. God, if this is true, I just want to say yes, yes to you this morning. Yes to your good plans. Yes to your goodwill. Jeremiah says it like this. He says, for I know the plans I have for you, declares the Lord. It's plans to prosper you and not to harm you. Plans to give you hope and a future. Jesus, we just want to take hold that you are good, that you're good all the time. And you're not just good on some distant throne, but that you're good right here in my life and that you're you're involved and you're active and that you have plans to shape and to change and to influence. And we say, would you come Holy Spirit, would you come and do your good work in me? My God can do more than you can imagine. My God can do more than you could ask. My God will do more than you can fathom. Even if all of your dreams come true, there will still be more than my God can do. I just want you to believe this about God. Get it in your heart that if you look at your circumstances, and maybe you, you're in need of healing in your body, or you're in need of a miracle in your finances, or you're in need of a miracle in your marriage, whatever it is, okay? I can't name everything that you need. But here's what I can tell you. I can tell you, God is bigger than every need, and He's better than you think He is, and He's interested in what's going on in your life. So I just wanna pray blessing. Father, would you release blessing into this church, into these people, that we would see your hand at work because you will do more than we could ever imagine, more than we could ask or think. Jesus, I pray that you'd release your grace for our circumstances and our needs and our miracles. And church, if you just, if you are even willing, maybe you don't even feel like you have the faith to ask, but if you're willing to say, God, here's my need this morning, here's my situation, then just present it before the Lord. Say, God, would you come and meet me where I need healing, where I need salvation, where I need your hand, your supernatural power. Just ask it, just present it, just bring it. Say, Lord, that's me. This is me, Jesus, needing you. I just want you to offer up your own prayer. Say, God, this is what I need. This is where I'm at. And if you really are bigger than we think you are and better than we think you are, and if you can do immeasurably more than we could ask or imagine, I'm saying, Lord, this is where I'm at. This is what I need in my family, in my circumstances, in my job. And I just say, would you come, Holy Spirit, and do those things? If we're willing to ask, Lord, would you be willing to respond? Let this be a day of miracles for us, God, that we'd see your hand at work mightily.